Welcome back guys to another beer review. Uh, you're watching all the beer, no idea, you know the crack, you know I'm bad, blah, blah, blah. Uh, we're off to an Aldi's beer now, and we're off to take a look at their Beck's ripoff, their own branded Beck's ripoff. And this is their Steinhauser German Lager, 330ml bottle coming in at 4.7%. £3.99 for six bottles. Uh, like the old label, that's quite cool, plain black bottle. Uh, gold bottle cap. Uh, it does say it's been brewed to the German purity law of 1516. So without further ado, let's get it out the bottle, get it into a glass and see what we get. It's a bit of an early one today. It's a bit of a cheeky little one, I've got to say. If you were getting that sort of weedy sort of smell to it, which doesn't necessarily appeal to me, I've got to be honest, it doesn't do it for me. But we'll see what it's like in the taste. Hopefully, I, you know, I know it's got that bit of a weedy smell to it. I'm hoping it's going to be promising. So uh, let's just take a look and see. Beer in a glass, yeah. Still getting that weedy sort of skunky sort of smell. Don't like it. Uh, it's looking a bit darker in, on the camera. It's sort of like a, a, a straw colour. Uh, slightly golden as well. Plenty of carbonation, as you can see. It's crystal clear. That's just a bit of chill haze, crystal clear. We've got a lovely two finger compact white head on top. Looks as you'd expect really. So let's dive in on the nose. And see if that smell gets any better. Yeah, that sort of... Get the nose right in there as usual. That smell, it's still got an inkling of that weedy sort of smell. For me, yeah, it has worn off a bit now the bottle's been open. But it's still there, quite sort of nettle sort of hoppiness to it, if you get what I mean. That's about it, really. It's all sort of like that sort of nettle, weedy sort of smell, I would say. Maybe an inkling of lemon. But that's about it, really. So without further ado, let's dive in. Cheers, everyone. Not too bad. Uh, it is Beck's like. I recall Beck's being. Beck's used to have that bit of a. I thought used to think it was quite a bit of a weedy sort of smell to it. Uh, body not too bad on the beer. You do. It's obviously still quite sort of light, if you like, because it's a lager, but. In terms of lager, it's actually got quite a decent body. Carbonation is there. I mean, that looks quite a lot, but it's actually not that bad. It does give you a nice feel in the mouth because of that. As in actual mouthfeel though, as in like smooth and soft. It's not really there for me. Taste wise. Clean, crisp, 4.7%. Drinking in that region for sure. Quite a bit of spiciness there. Quite a nice bit of tang. Uh, yeah, it's not bad really. Um, I mean, Bex has changed, hasn't it? Uh, but I always remember years and years ago, it was, it was always sort of, I always found it a little bit too harsh. Uh, I'm gonna say it was maybe a little bit too spicy, a little bit, I don't know, when you're younger, it, lager and everything can be a little bit a decent one can be a little bit too much, can't it? Uh, but but this does sort of remind me of Bex. Uh, yeah. Easily drinkable. It's quite warm today, but it's still early on. But if you're having a barbecue outside and the weather's good, you could down a few of these. Uh, 
I'm getting a bit, an inkling of sort of lemon in there as well, but it's one of them that's sort of clean, crisp. And for me, just full on sort of bitterness. Uh, it's sort of a bitter, bitter sort of spiciness to it. And it's one of them. And I think that helps with it being so clean and crisp. That adds to that for me. Uh, yeah, Audi's own sort of brand, if you like. Beck's ripoff Steinhauser German Lager. Uh, not a bad drop, really. Three ninety nine for six three hundred and thirty mil bottles. Uh, so what are we looking at? What are we looking at? I've got to work this one out now. I've gone. I've gone a bit stupid. About seventy p in it. Just under seventy p a bottle. <laughs> for me, decent value. Uh, so well worth picking up. So uh, if you're in Audis, you like. If you used to like Beck's, give this a go. Uh, well worth the money, I think. If you've had it before, let me know what you think. Feel free to comment, like and share and subscribe and all that malarkey. Uh, don't forget I'm on Facebook, all the beer no idea. Twitter and Instagram, all the beer no idea one. Hope you've enjoyed the video. That's it for this one and I'll see you again on another one. Cheers.